Well, look, as uh, we start out 1993, you're going to be working with the Brooklyn Brawler and going over on the house show loop. Jim, Steve Lombardi was a mainstay in the WWF for a long while and would even go on to have an office role. What can you tell us about Steve? I like Steve. I got along with Steve okay. You know, he got a lot of heat because he was a friend of Pat Patterson and a lot of people. But he was able to stick around in a very tough business to stick around that long. And come up with different characters that worked. I mean, you know, the Brooklyn Brawler, I, I kind of enjoyed that. And it was, you know, a good little spot. And he knew his spot and, and made his money and saved his money and did well in the business. So, yeah, I, I enjoyed working with the Brawler. It wasn't like we were working to potato. We both were gimmick guys. So we could go out there and entertain the folks without hurting each other. You know, it's, it's Which funny. Which was important like, back in the day because you were doing, you know, 20, 30, 40 days in a row. So you definitely didn't want to, you know, get injured. You needed somebody who's a good hand to be working with and somebody that you could trust in the ring. And like, look, you yeah. know, like a lot of a lot of people like to dunk on him and say like, oh, geez, you know, he never really made it very far. Not a big career. It's like, yeah, you know, he worked for a really, really long time in this yeah, industry. It's, That's... it's not a sports where you're trying to be the champion. That's not right. the idea of wrestling. <laughs> Holy shit. It's a work. <laughs> You don't have to be champion. You don't have to win all the time. You know, Bruiser Brody told me he'll put anybody over at any time. One, two, three, dead in the middle. Just let him get his stuff on after. Boom, get up, get your two by four, chase the guy out of the ring, chase the referee out of the ring. Oh, just happen to have one here, brother. <laughs> Come out and do what you do best, tough guy. Beat people up. Oh, you, <laughs> you got me wanting to get a two God, by four. I, get going. I can't help it, man. You, know? <laughs> you got me pumped up. Well, no, you're right. It's like, look, success is measured in how long did you work? How much money did you make over the course of that, that oh, career? It's a, Were you it's able to a feed job. Your family? We're not. Yeah. Everybody on the Dick Van Dyke show was not Dick Van Dyke. You know? <laughs> <laughs> right. That's a perfect way of putting it. Yeah, shit. I'm Ringo, baby. Go up there and sing uh, Hogan. And he's leading the band. Yeah, uh, yeah. People look at it as the, at the wrong. That's not the way to look at the, our profession. 